I started making my vision board in 2021 and this is my fourth vision board in 2024. And let me tell you how I turned my vision board into reality. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I am Disha Rathod. If you are new here, I make videos related to art, travel and spirituality. I hope I can help you through my videos in some or the other way. Pretty simple and very effective way to turn your vision board into reality. But first, let me explain you how the vision board works. You must be thinking it's so stupid to make a photo collage and stare to it every single day. I mean, who does that? You don't know how powerful it can be. But here's the thing, you can keep in check with your mini milestone from smaller to bigger goals every day by just looking to your vision board. I'm not saying that you will forget your goals, but it's a very easy way to keep your goals in your mind in front of your eyes every single day through vision board. And believe me, I've experienced that. Let me tell you the scientific reason why vision boards are so powerful. So every single day by looking to the vision board, your brain will send signals that this is a reality. Your brain doesn't know the difference between the imagination and reality. Slowly and gradually, you'll start behaving in that way that you will feel closer to your goals. If you want to earn a lot of money, you will start finding for the opportunities that are beneficial for you. So yes. So with that, how to make a successful vision board through my personal experience in three steps. Step number one, planning and breaking down. Firstly, you have to be very serious about your goals. What are the goals that you need to fulfill in this specific year? You have to first make categories, health, wealth, career, love life, relationship, personal life, etc, etc. I'll give you an example. In health, I will mention I want to lose fat. I want to start eating clean, going to the park, walking in nature, wealth wise, money. I want to earn this much money in this specific year. You have to be very, very specific about your goals. Go to Pinterest, Google or any source of media that you can download images from. The keywords that you have decided like the clean diet, walking in nature, jogging, you have to find the specific picture. You will find many like hundreds and thousands of pictures but you won't be able to connect with every single picture. So find that picture of your that you can connect with. Any specific picture when you will see it you will but naturally connect with the picture. Or you can use the source of AI. You can manuscript your particular imagination or any specific image you want to create you can put it in the ai tools start saving it collecting it or downloading the picture step number two action plan now the very common mistake everyone does is that we want it all and we want it now i did the same like when i first made my vision board i made my 10 years of plan in that small piece of paper and that's where I made the biggest mistake. I can't plan my whole 10 years in a one single piece of paper. Yes, it's good. I'm not saying there's any harm in that. You have to be much more focused for that specific year. So when I made my first 2021 uh, vision board, I, I found each and every picture from the whole internet. Uh, wherever I visualize myself in next 10 years, I downloaded all those pictures and I pinned it down to the vision board, which was wrong. And I couldn't achieve that, like my next 10 years goals, of course, because I didn't have any action plan. And that's where I made the biggest mistake and you guys will too. So you have to be very specific about your specific goal, for example, 2024, 2025, whatever goals you want to achieve in those specific year, you have to find those pictures. Let me tell you how I was successful in my last year's vision board and why did I fail in my previous vision board. So last year, I was very specific of my goals. Of course, I mentioned two, three things that was uh, for the next two years, which I was not able to complete. But the things that I visioned in 2023, oh my God, oh my God, you won't believe I have achieved every single thing from that vision board like i am getting goosebumps once when i started making the vision board i was not even aware that what is this thing and will it come true and i don't know i was very skeptical about it but i kept going i believed in myself that whatever i will put in this vision board or if i'm thinking if i'm also if i'm getting that thought in my mind that i have to do this 
so i knew i had that confidence in my mind that if i'm thinking about it i will definitely get it definitely and in 2023 oh my god i achieved so many things that i couldn't even believe myself till very moment so that's why i also thought to make the same video in 2022 but i had very like two three goals i was able to achieve that is also i'm very grateful about but like what would i have shared with you guys if i have not experienced it so yeah this year i made this video because i know i have achieved it and i wanted to share my wisdom to you guys i want to buy a specific car so i don't want to buy it in this specific year i want to buy it in next year so i will not put that in my vision board for this year so you have to make the vision board according to one year plan and then decide how will you get to it and the action plan will be the yearly plan you have to cut it down into monthly wise then monthly will go to weekly and weekly to daily for example daily talking about the fitness goal i want to achieve my goal my dream body in next 6 months so what i'll do i'll start working on myself daily i will eat clean i will start eating clean i will cut down sugar etc etc on daily basis now talking about monthly um or else the other example i want to read books every day so i will challenge myself i will challenge myself to read a book a specific book in a day or a specific book in a week i will read four books in one month now after a month where will i be very mindful and knowledgeable right so you have to break down your goals into days into weeks so how to achieve the bigger goals the daily basis the daily routine will play a major role in that and you have to create you have to be very consistent and very disciplined about that step number 3 visualize so this is the third and most important thing anyone can do if you are making a vision board so keep your vision board in front of you i have made two i have made three vision board of 2024 those three vision board are same but they are in different format so the first vision board is bigger in size it's a3 size and i have kept it on my cupboard and the second vision board is this which goes on my work desk and the third vision board is i have the cut out of the same vision board that i will be putting it in my planner If I'm not able to take my vision board wherever I'm traveling, or I can't be in my room, so I'll be having the, those cutouts in my planner, so I can anytime open my book, my planner, and I can visualize those goals. Also, I have a digital vision board in my phone through Pinterest, so my vision board is surfing around whenever I open my phone. Yeah, so I have. these many vision board and my phone and everywhere the first thing when you wake up and the last thing you do while you're sleeping is that you have to go sit with your vision board for 5 10 minutes you have to see each and every things that is in the vision board and you have to feel grateful you have to be in that aura you have to remind yourself about the goals that you have pinned down in your vision board yeah it's that simple you don't have to do any like rocket science thingy you just have to sit there you just have to visualize it you have to believe in yourself and if you are writing if you are journaling you can write about those goals you can be grateful about those goals in your vision board as a present tense so yeah this is a very very powerful technique because when we are sleeping and when we wake up our subconscious mind is very powerful at that time any piece of material that we are taking while we are sleeping before we are sleeping or the first thing when we wake up it depends it plays a very significant role in our lives so yes it's very good to visualize your goals the first thing in the morning and the last thing you do when you go to sleep So yes, I do this every day. I keep this vision board in front of me, and I also have planner. I script everything every day. So these are three simple and very effective things that made me achieve my vision board. 
if you want to know the exact things that i manifested i will definitely make another video for that see you in the next video you guys if i helped you in any way please subscribe to my channel and come back for more because i'll be making more of my personal experience videos that will definitely help you in future uh, thanks for watching and share your experiences if you have made any vision board in the comments below until then see you in the next video bye